Hi Megan, it's Dan over at Veracity Motors, 1701 East Main Avenue in Bismarck. My direct cell phone number is 701-527-8874. All right, so it was a pleasure speaking with you on the phone. I do have that 22 GMC Terrain Denali that you inquired about uh, on the telephone. I'm gonna do a quick walk around, point out any body flaws that I see, like I mentioned, and then we'll go inside and check out the interior and all the features that are included with this. Now this is the Nolly, so top of the line on the GMC, so it's gonna have lots of stuff in it. We're gonna try to, I'm gonna try to remember everything on it, all right? So it does have a factory car starter built in, LED HI headlights, as well as the daytime driver or daytime drivers that you see around the headlights there, and the LED fog lamps on the bottom. Parking sensors up front as well. Uh, nice looking rims on here. Tire tread is pretty good yet. And then we do have turn signal built into the side mirrors. Looks like we have some uh, soap residue here on the back on the on the plastic there as well. Does have push button lock and unlock on all four door handles. Blind spot indicators on here as well. Luggage rail up on top. This is black in color. I did notice there's a couple of scuffs right here. Nothing that's in the paint though, that could come off. I can have my detail guys take a look at that, see if they can buff that out. And then we do have parking sensors in the back as well, and it does have rear window defrost. Now this only does not only have a backup camera, but it has 360 degree camera as well. So you'll see all around your vehicle when you have it in reverse, which is very nice. And it looks like we got some kind of that that looks like it comes off too a little scuff right here but this here i don't know what this is looks like some kind of like uh soap or something i don't know we'll have like i said i can have the detail guys take a look at it see what's going on with that very nice let's go ahead and take a look at that cargo area now you can use the button on the cargo area in the back hatch or you can use the uh, fob here i just use the fob all right, so it looks like we have rubber mats for the entire vehicle here, front and back, which is nice. And then we have the levers here that knock down the back seats for you. Right there, just give it a pull, knocks down the back seat, 40-60 split. And then we do have a block heater built in, so there's your cord. And let's see, we have a spare tire under here, not a full size, but it is a spare, which is nice. All right, let's go ahead and take a look at the second row here. All right, we have nice looking wood grain trim here. Black leather interior, armrest right here. Looks like we have heated second row as well. And then we have two USB ports right here for you. And there's a three prong down here, three prong down here as well. All right, so powered seat for the passenger, powered seat for the driver. There's the Denali badge stitching right there. Leather's in great shape. We got Bose Premium Audio for this vehicle. Let's go to the driver's seat, take a look. All right, so we have a button for the hatch here. You can open it three quarter way. You can turn it off or you can do max open. Bose, two memory seat options. So you and your husband can have uh, each setting there if you want, easy exit for this one. Power windows, powered locks, powered side mirrors. We also have heads up display on here and then radio buttons behind the steering wheel as well. Push button start. And we have 23,556 miles on this one. Nice big digital speedometer right there in the middle. Automatic headlights as well as automatic brights on here as well. There's your wiper functions right here. And I don't know if you can see that, but there's a heads up display right there, that little screen. You can knock that, put that down, turn it off, turn it on. Right now I have, um, it says it has a lane keep assist on, the adaptive cruise control, speedometer, and uh, directional. You can change that information if you want. Here is the cruise control. It does have adaptive cruise control, which means that uh, you, the car in front of you is going slower than what your car is set at. It will come to a stop for you and also has collision warning, so it'll have emergency braking on here. Um, and then heated steering wheel as well, integrated telephone here. Nice big touch screen, we have AM, FM, Bluetooth, satellite, Apple CarPlay, Android Auto as well. Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, very nice. And you can have your Amazon Alexa set up on here if you want. Uh, automatic engine shutdown, you can set that up. 
uh, turn it on and off. Oh, it has built-in nav. Very cool. Uh, so you can turn that off if you want the engine shut down. Auto and dual temperature controls. And here is the shifter. A little different on the shifter. It's push button to park, pull to reverse, and I'll show you that 360 right there, 360. And it has all the different camera modes on here as well. It even has a camera that you can line up your trailer hitch if you're going to have a, a trailer hitch on there if you want. And then pull to drive. And then it goes to the front camera. And then we'll go push to park. There you go. And then we do have a 12 volt here, a USB Type-C, and an aux port. Cup holders. This does have park assist. It does have the um, parallel parking assist. I gotta be in drive. There we go. So it has parallel and perpendicular uh, parking assist on there as well. Very nice. I'm gonna turn that off. I don't want. And then we do have heated and cooled seats up front. You can turn your lane keep assist off. Downhill assist right here. The nice thing about this terrain is you can put it in two-wheel drive for the summertime, save yourself some gas, and then you can just throw it into all-wheel drive in the wintertime. Very nice. That's a nice little feature. I do like that. You have two USB ports in the center console, and then we do have a uh, universal garage door up on top, uh, auto dimming rear view mirror, and then we do have buttons for the moonroof, which is a panoramic moonroof, so it goes from front to back. just like that this side is the only one that opens up the other side stays closed we call that a, 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 a skylight very nice so this is the uh, 22 GMC terrain Denali my name is Dan please like and share this video and if you could Megan hit that subscribe button it helps me out quite a bit thank you for your time hope you enjoy this video let me know what you think